Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to modify the tow hitch connector for your Hisung Vector 500 ATV. That being said, let's go ahead and get started. These are the parts you're going to need for this project. First is this ATV hitch adapter that I picked up at Harbor Freight and this is for a two inch hitch. And this adapter comes with this three quarter inch bolt nut washer and lock washer and what you're going to use from this kit is just the washer and the lock washer then I also have this grade 8 three quarter inch by 10 by 4 inches in length bolt along with a corresponding washer and nut and then also this is a piece of three quarter inch EMT tubing that I'm going to use as a bushing to fill up the gap that's in the frame and I cut this to a length of two and one eighth inches this is the issue I had with this tow hitch adapter as you can see it's not very tight in there and it can bounce around side to side and up and down and I was using a bed extender to carry things up and down a hill and even though the extender had a caster mounted on the end it was still dragging on the ground because of the length of the extender this would bend all the way down and I didn't have access to any welding gear or anyone nearby that could actually weld this in there tight so what it I came up with is this bolt-on version and it seems to work pretty well. So what I did to figure out exactly the length of three-quarter EMT tubing I needed, I just went ahead and, and took what piece I had, slid it in there until it was flush with the exit hole on the bottom of the frame and then just marked it and then I'll make my cut. This is just a loose fit of everything put together so you can see. I've got the 4-inch bolt coming through the bottom here with the one washer. And then I've got the sleeve in here of the 3 quarter inch EMT conduit. And then underneath, between the frame and the adapter, I have the washer that came with the kit. Then on top of that, I have the lock washer that came with the kit. And then the new nut. And I'm going to go ahead and tighten everything all together. Okay, so I have all the pieces assembled and it's in there nice and tight. So that's it. If you have any questions, please leave them for me in the comments. Thank you.